WFNN. Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here, Monday, the 29th of July, just about to wrap up the month. And this is a 10 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. Dow is up nine at 40,600. It was up a lot. The futures were up quite a lot earlier. And then it uh, tumbled. It had a pullback of about 100 and something points. That was a spectacular uh, session on Friday. Well, it is up 14. And I I'd say to subscribers to my opening call that the 40,600s to the 40,720 area could be resistance this morning. We'll see if that's going to be the case. Uh, let's go to the S&P. The S&P has been up all morning and it's still up. It's up 27 to 54.86. Good action, but the 9 is still under the 14. The MACD is weak, stochastic is weak, on balance volume is weak. So this is a bounce within a sell signal to sell mode in the daily chart. The weekly chart is still fabulous. Q, 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 index 100 up 4.76 at 467.72. Very nice bounce. Didn't participate very much on Friday. This is the lagging, and this is my, my interpretation of this market is that you've got leadership in the Dow and the IWM, the Russell 2000 area, small caps. Uh, the others are having a, a very nice rest after a great, great session, uh, a great phase to the upside. Just needs a little bit of a breather here. IWM, you can see, is up 4.54, um, 4, 4, 4 uh, up 77 cents, sorry, at 224.90. Uh, uh, this is nice action. Trying to go for the 226.64, most recent uh, recovery high, yearly high, actually. Let's go to the gold. Gold is um, up 9 at 24.37. Pretty okay action considering that it's been digesting gains. Uh, dollar, actually, <laughs> this is very interesting. The dollar is up quite sharply. It's um, up 27 ticks at 104.59. But if you look at the chart, it's really just been going sideways in a consolidation pattern. It's really bonds that I'm looking at. Uh, bonds are up um, half a point at 119 and 26, 30 seconds. You want to see this continue so that rates come down because those grains are coming down. So there really is a deflationary aspect to this. Let's go to crude oil. Crude oil is uh, down. Oh, now it's up. Seven cents at 77.23, just in the lower range. I'll be back with the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check out my opening call, Daily News, at a good time with the Tiger sale going on right now to check out all these uh, uh, possibilities on TFNN. I'll be right back. The consistency you're looking for is closer than you think. One or